was the big three run home run. How were you able to deliver in that moment? And how big was that sequence of events before you Brasso getting on from the error and then Joey's big double? Um, I mean, obviously, you know, that was a big inning for us, but uh, great, great host by uh, Brasso, you know, getting on first on that play and, you know, Joey following with that double just to put uh, – the two guys on the scoring position, you know, we need we need we needed to score there to put the, 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 the to take a little bit of pressure of our, our pitchers and you know the whole team. But you know, uh, I was just happy that uh, I got the opportunity to hit the ball and you know, lucky that went out. Really, this is the ninth come from behind win for you guys this season. What's that say just about this group and how nice is it also to have a happy flight home? Uh, yeah, that's that, that was big. You know, we needed that, that happy flight because it's a long one. And, uh, it's, you know, it, it makes it makes it makes us to feel good about, you know, uh, about that, that we're coming back and we're winning games because we need that. You know, we I feel like we didn't do a pretty good job the first couple of weeks on that. You know, you know, when they score uh, in front of, before us, we kind of like weren't 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 playing. We weren't playing good, but you know, I think we're stand, starting to get that uh, good rhythm and you know that feeling again. That I think we the past two years we did a pretty good job on that, never never giving up. And now you know, I think we're getting back to it. So that makes uh, us feel good about it. And you know, hopefully we can continue to do that. Well, this might be fairly obvious, but how different of a dynamic is it for the lineup when you guys are hitting the ball over the fence the way you have? I mean, when you can show power in this lineup, just how different <laughs> is it? It is big for us because, like, we don't really, like, we're not a team that's going to hit a lot of homers. So whenever it happens, we have to, you know, uh, embrace it and enjoy it and try to, you know, continue to do it because it's contagious. You know, whenever you're doing good or somebody's doing good on the team, you know, it's kind of like contagious. So we're trying to, you know, pick up each other, try to, you know, to help each other to, you know, give a little bit of uh, um, support to, to, to every teammate. And uh, I think we, we're doing a pretty good job on that, a pretty good job on that. And, you know, it's, it's, it feels good. Evan, we'll start with Willie Adamas. Bross gets on on the error. Wendell with the big double. And then Willie, one swing of the bat and everyone's home. How big was that sequence of events in that home run? Pretty big. Uh, you know, again, it was tough. Irvin had had us off balance. You know, we hit some balls hard, kind of those Adam balls, but he pitched really well, made it tough. But that was a big hit by Willie. Uh, big hit by Willie, big hit by Bross. Um, you know, it was good to see the guys bounce back after getting down 3 nothing. You know, really salvage a road trip. We played, we got to be pleased going 5-2 and two, uh, on this trip. So we are. You mentioned Brasso, the home run to take the lead. How good was that to see from him in the midst of that kind of tough os- offensive stretch that he was going through? Yeah. Um, look, he's been pitch tough. He's been expanding, trying to do a lot. Bross is, is passionate and cares as much as anybody we have. Uh, so anytime you come up with a big hit like that, it's, it was huge for us, huge for him. Um, like to see him keep going, even his last at bat after that. Uh, he, he had another really good at bat. So maybe that's a, a, a sign of some things to come. And then there was that moment in the bottom of the eighth, Zunino to Wendell for the tag to end the inning to get Olsen out. How big was that to eliminate that threat in that moment? It was big. I mean, that's <laughs> not how we draw it up, but, uh, you know, we'll, we'll take it. You know, we're playing an Oakland team that has played us extremely tough. It seems like every little thing matters in these games, whether it's us doing it or them doing it. Uh, and, you know, we, we, we were fortunate to, to have the ball not go too far away and good for Joey and Z to have the awareness that there was going to be play over there and ultimately make the play. Kevin, what did you think of Shane today? It seems like really just that one stretch was kind of the only place where things went wrong for him. Yeah, really good. Uh, re- really good again. Um, you know, he left a, I think he left a slider up to Piscotti. Um, I, I believe that was the first run. I'm not sure, but, uh, left the slider up to, to one of them. Uh, other than that, I mean, if we're nitpicking one pitch and outing, you're doing pretty good. Um, 
you know, his pitch count just got a little higher or at that point where we were getting to the, you know, it was more comfortable to take him out than leave him in. Uh, but really, really pleased with Shane and just an outstanding effort by our bullpen. Uh, everybody that came in uh, was just had to be spot on lights out. And, and they really were. You touched on it earlier too, but just what's the feeling kind of heading back after this five and two trip end of that stretch of 17 games in a row, just kind of what's the, the feeling heading back home. Well, we got to be excited. You know, we left, we left home uh, wanting to play better baseball. We, we did, um, you know, we went to Anaheim and, and found ways to win. And then, you know, we were in every single game, every single inning here. We came up short the first two nights, but it's a huge credit to the guys. They don't get frustrated. They stay at it um, and came out and just really competed well. And, 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 you know, we got, we got the big hits that were, were huge. And then we should be feeling good about getting on a flight to go back home now. Kevin, they always say, you know, three run homers can solve a lot of problems. You got one today, you got one a few days ago. And overall in the series, you had nine homers in the seven games. Just just speak about how valuable the power was for you on this trip. Pretty valuable. Uh, home runs can, can you know, make a lot of questions go away. Uh, you know, the offense has been kind of grinding, battling through a little bit of a tough stretch here. Uh, but those home runs can, can really help alleviate questions after the game. Uh, so I know it's one swing of the bat, but when you got some guys on, it was, it's, it's, it's huge. And today was no bigger with Willie's. And one more thing. Do you have any idea how the pitching lines up going home on Tuesday? Uh, not quite yet. Uh, pretty confident Patino will start on Tuesday. Um, you know, we got some decisions to make with Michael Waka where he's at. He's going to get off the mound on Tuesday a little bit and see how the hamstring's feeling. And then that, that'll that give us a little bit more clarity into the, the New York series. Was that the idea behind not doing the McClanahan Patino thing today is potentially holding him to, to start then or just the way today's game sorted out? No, that was a plan. We were really looking to avoid Luis today. I mean, he was available if we needed him, but we would kind of express like the thought was that he was going to start the, the, the first game against uh, New York.